because May is Mental Health Month, but we always have to be aware and conscious of our health in general. And joining the Splash Live right now to talk about a health and wellness fair that is coming up in the month of June, we have Executive Director for the Greater West Bloomfield Chamber of Commerce, Suzanne Levine, joining the Splash. Thank you so much for your time, Suzanne. Thank you for having me join you today. <laughs> Absolutely. So we want to talk about this um, health and wellness fair that is coming up June 11th, 11 a.m., 2 p.m. Just talk a little bit more about it, what we are expecting. Is there registration uh, that we have to do? Any costs associated, please? Well, this is our 15th annual health and wellness event. It's a great event where the entire public is uh, involved and it's free to the public. Um, we have a variety of different medical and health and wellness uh, vendors that will be there. There is a cost for them to participate, but there are going to be all kinds of medical information, ways for people to increase their longevity, sustain their um, health, and also learn about all the different health and wellness options in our community because we know that it's better to... Uh, to make sure that you have all the information at hand so you can make informed decisions about your health. Correct, correct. And, and <clears throat> why do you think resources, events, and information like that is specifically important for the residents of the greater West Bloomfield area? I don't think that people really take enough uh, advantage of all the different fabulous medical and health and wellness facilities we have in our community. And the more informed you are, the better you are able to make decisions for yourself and for your family. Um, because we know that no matter how good you look, if you don't feel well, that's going to impact every aspect of your life. And so the whole point is to age well and to make sure that your family has all the information they need at hand to make these great, important decisions. I mean, there's nothing more important than your health other than your family. So, you know, we're welcome the public. There'll be lots of free swag, which we know people love. Um, there's all other options there. I know Drip IV is going to be there, so there'll be like free B12 shots. Uh, maybe you, I don't know how you do all that you do <laughs> without uh, mm -hmm. energy. Yep. Um, Henry Ford Westmanville Hospital will be there to answer questions. Um, and we also have a lot of assisted living places because we know that, you know, taking care of our seniors is very important. Right, right, correct. And that's what I want to get through. So we do have a lot of seniors in our area, so we want to make sure we take care of them. Even the youth, even the people in between the parent. It's good to know this type of information. Have an opportunity to just be able to have a discussion about health care without having to go to the doctor or Absolutely. something like that. So, <clears throat> And we know that our young, you know, the sports injuries, and people have a lot of people, you know, think that they can just exercise and do certain things. But everything you do now impacts your future, your joints. Um, I, we're, yeah. at, we're currently, um, we're at uh, Letterman Portraits uh, Orthopedic Center. Um, it's my wealth meeting, my wellness and health professionals. And so... Nothing is more important than keeping your joints well. You know, we know that the pickleball is a big thing for um, the 40 to 50 year olds, you know, running, you know, jogging, uh, all the football, uh, you know, the people at the high school, all their sports. So keeping yourself healthy at a young age impacts how you age. So it's, it's really important to have all the information to know maybe there's certain supplements you should be taking. Maybe you should be doing something proactively exercise wise. Correct. Correct. Yep. And then this is the place to get that type of information. Ask those questions and, and start a little bit early just to be a little bit proactive. Join us on the Splash Live right now, Executive Director for the Greater West Bloomfield Chamber of Commerce, Suzanne Levine, talking about the health and wellness fair, June 11th, 11 to 2, 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. Uh, that we will that will be free and available to the public. Now, one thing I do want to talk about, you have the word teamwork behind you. Let's right. talk about the collaboration between the Chamber of Commerce and okay. our local health care providers to kind of make this event possible. Can you just talk about the importance of that collaboration and how it, how it uh, came to be? Oh, absolutely. Well, uh, as you know, West Bloomfield uh, Hospital, Henry Ford West Bloomfield Hospital, is the biggest employer in our uh, neighborhood. And they are called upon all the time to help service our community. They're there to help with their doctors and they have wellness programs. 
So they're an important um, supporter of our chamber and our community. Um, West Bluefield Parks and Rec, they're another really big community member and we were so happy to honor them at our Michigan Week breakfast. Um, our library, all these people are great resources for information. And we have other people like Letterman Portrowitz. We have um, Grover Health who was here with us today. We have um, our home care affinity. These are all people that want to service our community and make sure that we stay healthy and vibrant. Um, because we know that this is what makes a community great. It's not just our resources, but you know, our business community and a West Winfield Township has been a great supporter of our health there. And that's where we're holding right. uh, again this year. We're very appreciative for all their support. Yeah, and it just goes into the type of support that they have for the community beyond the regular services that they provide. They actually put their, their time and their resources together and their staff to actually provide information, free events like this, which I right. want to kind of make very, you know, important because or, or, or a highlight because the fact that it's free but still people have to pay you know get paid to do their job to come there so that's not that's not anything to just let by the uh, by the wayside Suzanne I want to thank you again for your time and for coming on today any last words any additional information key information to let the community know about this event I would before I let ask, you go I'd like to ask everyone at my help excuse me everyone you want to just quickly pop in and say hello to the splash and make sure you watch them. And yes, it's really important that we support our business community. It's really important that we understand that all our health and wellness, uh, these are all health and wellness professionals that are here today to say hello. And uh, we have more than hello. I can die. <laughs> um, but these are all the great people that work to make sure that our community stays healthy and wealthy and wise, and um, we love West Bloomfield, and I, I personally will do everything I can to make sure that our community stays vibrant. And thank you for all that you do too. Uh, I, I've been told that one of you will be at our, um, our health and wellness event to interview people and to show all the different great resources that our community provides. Absolutely, Suzanne. We will be present for that. Thank you again for your time. Thank you for introducing or at least showing us some of the people that's making this possible. We appreciate it. Suzanne Levine, Executive Director for the West Greater West Bloomfield Chamber of Commerce, join us to talk about the health and wellness fair going on June 11. Thank you again for your time. Thank you for having me. Have a great day. Absolutely.